Good morning everyone, Bridget here. Welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm just going to show you a very simple uh, stew, uh, my way, with just carrot, beans and potatoes. So <clears throat> if you like you could add chicken as well. But um, today I thought I'd go for a just a veg stew made with carrot, beans and potatoes. So these are the ingredients that you'd be needing for the stew. Sliced onion, cinnamon, cloves, peppercorns, chopped tomatoes and green chilies. Then beans, carrots, potatoes, ginger garlic paste, salt and pepper powder. So heat. 2 tablespoons of oil in a pan and you add the cinnamon, cloves and peppercorns and fry for a few minutes like to bring out the aroma of the spices. Once you see that um, they are frying well, you could add in your sliced onions and green chilies. Now you fry the onions nicely till light brown you could fry on high heat and uh, the onions give out a lovely aroma while frying so wait till they turn light brown so once they turn light brown you could add in your ginger garlic paste and fry for a few minutes Okay, fry this for a few minutes till the raw smell of the ginger and garlic uh, go away. Now you can add in one teaspoon of pepper powder and again fry for a few minutes. Maybe just one or two minutes. Now you can add in your chopped tomatoes. Fry well. And then Add salt to taste. Again mix and fry well. Okay, you continue to fry for some time. So continue to fry for some time. Now add in your potatoes, beans and carrots and mix well. Mix well. You could raise the heat a little. Just like a few minutes. And then you add 2 or 3 cups of water or stock. And bring to boil. If you have stock it's good. Otherwise just 3 cups of water. 2 or 3 cups of water and bring it to boil. Now you cover with the lid. And cook on medium heat till the vegetables are tender. This should take around say uh, 8 to 10 minutes. You'll be able to see that the vegetables are cooking well. Now you can add half a cup of coconut milk and mix well. So I've used uh, like 3 tablespoons of uh, coconut powder, Maggi coconut powder with half a glass of water and made it into coconut milk. You could cover and simmer for a few more minutes and then remove the lid and stir. You can see that your stew is now ready. So switch off the heat and is now ready to be served. Such an awesome aroma coming out of our stew this is good for lent uh, when you want to um, just cook something vegetarian so this is a good dish to be served during lent and so our uh, veg stew is ready a simple stew made with carrot potatoes and green beans I added coconut milk as a thickening agent if you don't have coconut milk please don't worry 
You could use any thickening agent such as corn flour. Maybe you could add two tablespoons two teaspoons of corn flour with a little uh, water and mix it in to thicken it or even just plain flour and um, you could add chicken while cooking if you need a chicken and vegetable stew but this is quite nice to eat on a rainy day and um, goes well with bread dinner rolls also with sanas or with um, your dosa and idli as well so add chapatis too and um, such an easy dish uh, to prepare. Please um, like and share this video if you liked it and uh, as always I ask you to ask your friends to subscribe uh, to my YouTube channel. Thank you and uh, have a lovely day.